There's a pillager. And a whole bunch of them. I just killed a bunch of them. On the roof. Why are they on the roof? Hello fellow Mythicraft fans and welcome back to another episode of Mythicraft Season 2. This is episode 15 and we have some big plans for today's episode as usual. Um, last episode we dug a giant hole and this episode we're gonna keep doing it. Um, hopefully it will be, we'll do more than that definitely. Um, but yeah that will be what we'll, what we'll be doing for a good portion of this is getting the island ready to build the only mountain which is gonna be epic but yeah it's it's gonna be a while because episodes take a long time to make right now because I have a ton of school work and stuff because the school year is wrapping up um, and we have a lot going on so there is not much time to be on Mythicraft, which is sad. In fact, this is the first time I've been on in a week. It is currently Friday the 15th, and this episode is not going to come out until Sunday, a week from now. Two weeks from then. Two weeks. Took a really long time. I had so much going on. So, yeah. It's unfortunate. Every two weeks for now is what episodes is coming out. But, yeah. That's just what's happening. So, I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you do, please leave a like. I would greatly appreciate it. And let's get into it. Here it is. Home sweet hole. We are at the future location of the Warren Inn and the Only Mountain, of course. And if you missed last episode, this is what we did for part of it. Um... We have the flying machine set up right there, but we need to move it over a little bit for the next digging section. And yeah, so that's the plan. We're going to dig for a long time. And I've got the areas over here filled out with dirt and over here too, all the lakes and stuff. So now should be good to just dig that area away. I don't know how far I'm gonna go with the TNT duping, but Probably right now it's looking like to around here and then I'm gonna flatten all of the rest of the land to be at uh, That same Y level that's for all of this area over here Also, I don't know if you can tell but it is lagging quite a bit right now <laughs> um, Yeah, so that is the plan and I'm gonna start moving that TNT duper over and we can get this ready to keep going again but I will probably not focus on it as much this episode because we already saw that last episode we don't need a whole nother episode of the same thing so yep that is the plan right there let's get going and I've rebuilt it over here and let's set it off. Also, I got a the Vanilla Tweaks texture pack, so that's nice. This appears to be working, so that's all good. Let's hope it hits the other side correctly, and I will come back once there's been a lot more progress, because it's not interesting to just have these updates every once in a while. And there has been a lot of progress. A lot, a lot of progress. Check this out. This area is all dug out. It went right up to the ocean. In fact, I had to do a bit of <laughs> damming there and there. Um, but yeah, we have this whole area all dug out. I might move it back over here to dig this out at a later date but for right now that's looking like a good portion dug out and so now we just have to you know flatten the rest of it but I am very sick of digging so let us go do something new I have recently made a new design for an ender pearl stasis chamber I made a video about it earlier last week and it is really, really simple. 
So what I'm going to do is I'm going to make a senate building kind of thing and in it we will have enderpearl stasis chambers for everyone so that when we have meetings and stuff we can summon everyone there easy peasy. So let's go get the materials for that and then we'll get building. And we have got the materials we need and we found a location that should work for this purpose. It is right on the side of that cliff face by the mall, or the shopping district, and it'll have a nice view of all of that. So this is going to be a very epic second building. Time lapse time. Let's go. Okay, and we've been designing for a while. That looks trash, ignore it. Um, and we have some white concrete power. It's like the Star Wars powder. sequels. Every time I look at it, it gets worse. <laughs> uh, yeah, and Vader's Dolt is actually in my house. Welcome back. Um, that sounded way more creepy <laughs> than you intended it to be, I think. <laughs> no, it was supposed to be like that. Okay. Um, and <laughs> okay. now we are going to make a concrete thing. So yeah, ignoring the comments, we should be all fine now. <laughs> Let's go. Okay, well we've got some, and we've got this, and we just went for like an hour of just getting the concrete, and luckily we only did like two or three shulker boxes of it, so it doesn't really matter, but then we realized you can just like make the wall out of the powder and just put water buckets across the top. We're complete idiots, okay? We've never done this before, okay? Okay? <laughs> We're idiots. <laughs> What can we All right. say? Yeah, okay, let's let's just keep building. <laughs> Not idiotly, hopefully. How'd that work? What the? Yeah, we appear to have got it. That's epic. That is epic. And we have gotten more progress. I love this scaffolding, by the way. It looks epic, but it's, it's not going to stay. Kind of no, um, it's not. Yeah, so we've exchanged this for white glass and stuff, and it looks better. Um, and we've got the walls all concrete. Um, and yeah, we've got sea lanterns in there. Thank you, Onan Shop. Thank you. Um, and Owen's then shop coming in clutch for yeah, once. For once. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Owen. Your shop is useless eighty percent of the time, but when we need it, we need it. Thank you. That's overpriced. Um, <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, this place looking mighty fine, and hopefully we can get in some cool looking quartz pillars and stuff, because right now it's kind of looking, kind of giving me the X-Men vibes of that room that Charles Xavier uses to see into the world. I don't know what it's called. What's it called? Cerebro. That's what it is. Um, yeah. Well, <laughs> let's keep building this. All right. Several hours have passed. And we have got a ton of item frames, as well as this room a bit more sorted out. Well, quite a bit more. So, yeah, I don't remember when we last checked it out, but I think it was nowhere near this. <laughs> um, He's right, you know. It's looking epic. And Veo Stolt here is about to make a chandelier. And then I'm about to put all the item frames in here. That's infuriating. And then wow. we are going to build a table. So yeah, that is a progress report, and we'll get back to you when the room is probably done. Welcome, my friends, to the Senate. What the hell happened here? <laughs> this is the dumbest chair. <laughs> but apart from that, we've made some very good progress. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We have. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. yeah let's let's go over that instead of um, that. The maps will make it look so much cooler. Yeah, but this is this is a room now. This we is a room a and a half. We need a project of just getting maps. <laughs> that's a really big project. That's like two episodes worth of project. <laughs> yeah, so progress, progress, progress. And we're going to keep working. And fix that chair. Please, God, fix that chair. <laughs> <laughs> I won't. And we have finished it apart from maps. So drum roll. Ta-da. I absolutely love it. We've got some Senate banners around the outside with falcons, and then the Senate leader, chancellor banner right there. 
with his chair and we all have chairs here for the five of us. This is going to have maps of the shopping district and then that's going to be maps of everything else. Um, got a chandelier, a bunch of epic stuff in the dome. It is just looking mighty fine and I absolutely love it. I cannot wait to see the rest of the area coming together. Um, yeah, it is going to be so, so epic. We'll see how far we go with this Senate thing, with the building that is obviously the Senate itself will continue, but um, yeah, this is, this is a really good start to it and I'm really looking forward to this project. Let's keep working. And we have been working for a while and ta-da, we have an entrance. I can see white run from the mall, I didn't even know that, my god. The new That's black epic. area is crazy. Um, so this entrance is pretty entrancey. It's got this. I feel like we should put pillars along the andesite part. Yeah, probably. Yeah, it's it's a bit plain for now, and we can't have these torches, so we need to get some more sea lanterns. Some more sea lanterns. But, overall, it's coming along. I don't like this water thing, though. I need to do something about that. But yeah, we'll just keep on chugging along and keep on doing these updates, which may or may not be annoying. <laughs> <laughs> Let's hope they aren't. So, Veyu Stolt has just left, and we have made some incredible progress. We're probably going to do more in this episode uh, at some point. Oops. But here is our entrance hallway that you fly into. We've got a nice little fish tank. Might need to add in some more lights here. It's a little bit dark. We have this hallway into this hallway, which is not finished. And it's going to have a nice big balcony of some kind that probably is shaped similarly to that, except bigger. Ceiling is going to be vaulted, probably. Um, we have this little closet here with all our stuff, because I was just sitting in the hallway before. And then we have this room, which I had shown already. And yeah, it's going to be a very epic building. So once we have these all done, we're going to move on to the Enderpearl Stasis chamber room with the summoning chambers and everything. Then we're going to have offices for all of the five members of the Senate. And yeah, and then we're gonna probably make another room for a general assembly of everyone rather than just the five of us, which are Neocat, Jmurf, uh, Mampersat, me, Mythology5, and Veyu Stolt. And yeah, so, we have got some good progress, but now that he is gone, uh, we are going to move on to do some other stuff for a while. And the first one is, there is a new little game that Niwocat has made with a prize of five diamond blocks, which is epic. Thank you, Niwocat. So, welcome to the banner challenge. Take this banner and put it next to your bed. Anyone can take it and put it next to their bed. The player to have it last wins. Ends June 15th. Message Niwo for questions. No hiding the banner. No duplicating the banner. No hiding your bed with banner. Okay. Well, pretty simple enough. Someone's already taken it. And I know who it is because it's Veyu Stolt. So, I'm going to go grab it and bring it to my bed, which is really, really far away from everyone else, so maybe people won't actually find it, but we'll see. The game has just begun, so we don't know. Alright, um, here it is. The banner. Hurrah. And let us bring it to Fuwarinen. And another good thing about this game is it means people are going to be going to each other's bases and seeing what they're building and stuff, which hopefully should get more people to keep building and stay motivated to work and stuff because they'll see everyone else's cool builds. So that's a good idea, Onan, of having it with the bed, but I imagine eventually it'll just be us randomly going to everyone's houses to see who has it, but <laughs> we'll see how it goes. Well here we are at the future site of Vuorinen and the only mountain, so let's put the bed here, or the banner here I mean. There's that, and yeah. And although it may seem like it's just been seconds since we were working on this, it's actually been 
several days that we've been busy and stuff, but we've gotten back and kept working on it. This is going to have to be shifted over a few blocks because it doesn't line up. But check this out. This has taken a very incredibly long amount of time to fill in, and this whole project is going to take an incredibly long amount of time to finish. But it's looking really epic. We've got the shopping district right there. Got my floating island right there. Got Justin's place right there. Got a bunch of other places that I may or may not have been in episodes. I don't really remember. The stronghold's way over here somewhere. Um, it's, uh, I'll tell you which one it is in a sec. It's this one. It's this one? Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's this one. See the little black dot of the portal? Ah, uh, yes. <laughs> yeah, so that's where the stronghold is. And then way over here, this is going to be kind of like how on a map of the United States you have Alaska and Hawaii off to the side, even though they're not connected there is my land it's got some maps i have yet to fill in but it's looking kind of epic and then up here we have this map chandelier um that is yeah it's the mall at a larger scale um yeah and as you can see we're right here in that hill um so yeah, good progress there. Um, we need to move this over, as I said, which is going to be absolute suffering. And also sorry for the excess background buzzing that is a fan because it's currently like 90 degrees out, which is absolutely awful. I don't know what just happened, but that was audio. And we are going to keep working and get back to you when we've got some more progress. Welcome back, Justin. We have been taking a lot of stuff from Justin, though. Emeralds, that is. So I would like to help him out because we've been taking so much and give him the stuff I have in my inventory right now. Let me first go into his place so I don't get slaughtered by mobs. I have all of these, which are filled with rotten flesh. I would like to make a big stack of these. And there we have it. All of these, or most of them, are filled entirely with rotten flesh. One of them is almost entirely filled. And hopefully he'll be able to use those to get a ton of emeralds. And it also gave us an excuse to empty out the uh, zombie pigment farm because that had been an absolute mess of stuff and was not collecting all the gold we needed it to. So, now that's all settled, and yeah, let's get back to building the Senate building. And now some more progress has been completed. This hallway is back to existing, and the uh, flags are up in here. We shifted some stuff around in the floor. I put a light in there. I don't know if I'm going to keep it like that. It looks a bit weird, but we'll see. And then, yeah, we're going to be having a meeting pretty soon for the first, the first Senate meeting. So I actually have a new skin, and I've made everyone else Senate skins as well um, that are basically the same as this. So yeah, this is going to be pretty fun. Um, if the meeting is interesting, we are going to be talking a bit about different types of policies and stuff that we're implementing just because that's what we do as the Senate. I don't usually record our meetings because they're not especially interesting for someone that's not in the Senate. So if it's interesting, I'll put some of it. And if it's not, then I won't. Simple as that. So let's get to it. Guys, this is scary. What? Yeah. Oh! Oh my god. The most valuable set it on right now. Oh, Ross, you did that, see? You put it in the minecart, boy. I don't know, I just hit you. Alright. Alright, let's start this meeting off. Alright, Senators, I guess I'll do it because, I mean. You heard the answer on that, I'll call it an order. Sounds good. Yeah, so today we are here in the Senate room that we made, and 
we have the first meeting of the five senators of Mythicraft in one room on this, so that's epic, and the room is sort of like half complete, the ground isn't, but everything else is, and then we have the other rest of the senate building in progress. Why is my torso in the chair? It's because the chair, you need to push it forward a bit. There we go. Um, uh, well, Connor's got pushed out of the chair, and Justin's did too. I literally, like, we didn't even get through five minutes before a meeting started, and they already broke the chairs. <laughs> so true. So anyway, yeah, today we're going to be addressing two things. First thing, what we eat. Do you guys like the new Senate quarters so far? Mm -hmm. It's not complete yet, but... Oh, and Ethan, I finished this room. I don't know if you... Yeah, this is all done now. And then look, the I, lo I continued the pillars into the ground when they're next to glass because it looked bad. And now try to run out the door. Try to run out and fall to your death. Yeah, I just noticed, I was like, hey, I could put those there and now people won't like fly out and run into their death. Uh, also, why are these droppers? Who because it looks cool. What? <laughs> Note on currency. All right. Well, this was a good meeting, lads. All right. And I'm not repairing the chairs because they're just gonna get broken again. <laughs> not worth. <laughs> I'll leave. I was gonna stay and work a little bit on White, white Run, but I also worked on it a long time. Yeah, and I don't know, I'm not really motivated to work after that, like, what was it? Two hour meeting? Or one hour meeting. So, I'm just gonna probably go edit. Which is also working, but, you know. <sighs> so wrong. Alright. Alright, see ya, mate. Goodbye. And that's it. We had a good Senate meeting, and now we have run out of time. I mean, we ran out of time like two weeks ago. I know this episode is super late, sorry about that. I've been really busy with homework and stuff, but what better way to end another episode than by the way that we usually end episodes? Buying Onan out of stock again. So, here's another 23 diamonds. And all of these are almost filled, other than that one, with stone. We can take all these. That's sad. So yeah, that is the best way to end a Mythicraft episode in my opinion. And it's probably a trend by now. <laughs> so, yeah, we have had a good episode. Uh, we did find out that the flag was not actually supposed to start being part of a game yet. Um, so we're doing that, and I also moved the shulker box shop. Um, and also the nether is black now, it's weird. Um, but yeah, so let us get back to the base, and put these things in the storage, and return the flag back to where it's supposed to be. But that is gonna be it. So, I thank you so much for watching, I hope you've enjoyed. And I do not enjoy this lag, but I hope you've enjoyed the video. If you did, please leave a like. I would greatly appreciate it. And we'll see you in the next one. So, thanks again. See you later. Goodbye.